This is the uh, Turnbridge home, 48 Turnbridge. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick video inside, but I wanted to just open up the garage door and show you what, what there is um, here to work with. So the, at, at first glance, it is just a, a two car garage, but then you do have this space over, over here that I was thinking might, might just work. Um, if I stand about here, which is where I think your other cars would come to, um, I think that I'll measure this and send it along in an email, but I think it, it looks to me like, like you would have enough room. I brought my, as I mentioned, I brought my husband with me and he thought that, that this space over, over here would give you enough room. Um, I'll just show you the rest of the garage as well. This is the rest of the garage space, so the Escalade and, and uh, the Porsche should be fine. Um, I will go inside and do a quick video of the house. I'm not sure, to be honest with you, about the, uh, about the backyard. I have a sneaking suspicion that that, that might not be big enough, so <laughs> we have one out of two, but I'll, I'll be right back to you. So coming, coming in from the garage, we come into a uh, mud room. Uh, into a mud, mud room and laundry area. Yeah, this isn't the ideal way to come into the house, um, but I'll kind of run with it here. Half bath here, this is the, the great room. This is the front of the, the home. We'll just kind of come over here to give you some perspective, what you see when you first walk in. So you have the front, front entrance and coming into the home you have your your dining area to the right and your great room that's opened up to the kitchen you have a gas cook cooktop in in the kitchen of course hardwood floors throughout walk-in pantry cooking island here Just a look over to the fireplace and built-ins sliders that open out onto the deck. And I'd really, if you're, you know, if you're interested in in this home, um, I can dive in and see if there is room out here for the for a pool. Um, it is Trex decking out here. You, and I'm sure that the lot line, well, you can see the stake right over here. So it's looking a little bleak in terms of yard space. You might be able to sneak a small pool in through here, remove these, uh, this bedding, plant bedding here and, and have, have the space. But uh, we'll see what you think about the rest of the home. And if you'd like, I will, we'll do some investigating. So you have the master on this side of, of the home with a double crown molding inside. Nice bath. His and definitely her closets. Dual sinks with a makeup area, pantry and tub, and a nice walk-in shower and private commode. It's not a huge master, but it's a, it's a decent size. You have a coat closet here. other side of the house gives some nice privacy away from the master. 
We have a bedroom on, on this level, single vanity, nice walk-in, and then going up a half a flight. And this is going to be over the garage. With a walk-in shower and a single vanity, nice closet. Again, really nice, nice bedroom separation, or this could be uh, a media room up here. And let's take a look at I'm sure this is access to HVAC. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's actually access to your water heater and storage. Nice use of space by the builder. Have a little loft area up here. Another walk-in walk -in shower and vanity and then a nice big, big room pretty much over the kitchen area. Give you another quick perspective. And this is a good sized room. Um, give you another quick perspective from up here of the uh, the view of the pond lagoon down below it certainly is enough room uh, for the for your goldens you know enough se separation between here and over there for the goldens especially with these young palms down here and then the pool potential area for a pool down down below I hope this helps VJ and um, the other house uh, I'll send this to you in, in an email but yeah the uh, the other home the garage did not have that additional space, so I did not do a video of it. Um, but um, yeah, so I just I didn't I didn't bother doing a video of it because the garage was I, I believe it was twenty twenty five by twenty four, so probably wasn't going to be a good fit for the for the three cars. Um, I'll talk to you soon.